Peter Obi is meeting with delegates from Sokoto and Zamfara states as part of his tour of the country, which has seen him and his campaign team visit 29 states at the moment. While meeting the teams, he explains his vision for a new Nigeria, while promising to promote peaceful coexistence, national unity, rapid infrastructure development and job creation to tackle Nigeria's huge unemployment rate, which continues to breed insecurity. Obi was also received by Sokoto State Deputy Governor Muhammad Enia on behalf of the state government, where they shared ideas on governance and concluded that PDP remains the best party to produce Nigeria's next president. We used to be one family. We used to be together. You could see the daughter of Ekweme coming here so proudly, adorning the clothes of Shagari and Ekweme. And this is how we used to live, where we we're hoping for the best. We are very delighted uh, to see our leaders coming together to understand each other and uh, to make uh, progress in our great party. So we wish them well and uh, we pray Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to continue to guide them in discharging their uh, duties. On Obi's campaign team is the daughter of Nigeria's former vice president, late Alex Ekweme. She's wearing the campaign material of her late father and late former President Sheo Shagari, who hailed from Sokoto State. She says there's need for continuous political handshake across the Niger, which is at the heart of Obi's campaign. Peter Obi's heart is in the right place. I know that my dad's heart was in the right place. He loved Nigeria with a passion and he was a selfless man. Very simple, very humble. I see a lot of that in Peter Obi. Um, from his lifestyle, I think everyone has seen it now. We've, the past few days we've been all over Nigeria and the people of Nigeria have felt now it's, it's a wave, it's a movement, it's a cause because we all feel the same thing. We all live in Nigeria and we can all see that indeed there is hope for a better Nigeria. Today I think we've done about 29 states or thereabouts, very close to that. Uh, it's clear to me from what I've seen and um, I'm a very experienced politician, and I know what I'm talking about. It would be impossible to defeat Peter Obi in this primary. It's absolutely impossible. I know I can turn around this country and put it from consumption to production. And as I go around the country, seeing the innermost potentials of the country, as go out back sleep every night thinking we can do this, we can do this, we can do this. The Peter Obi Presidential Campaign Council says it has received more positive reviews in the last one week since it began a tour of northern states and says it will conclude meeting with delegates in all states across the country before the May 28th National Convention. Somna Sambu, Arise News, Sokoto.